it's got like legit padding. What the heck? Look at this. It's like these turnbuckles are legit. What the heck? Look at that figure. What's that Rollins figure next to this ring? This thing is legit. <laughs> We're over here making some t shirts with this sweet logo. Got the heat press going. Matt's about to burn the place down with a box. <laughs> Oh, yeah. And yeah, I dropped my bike a minute ago, so that's cool. <laughs> There's a cat that I named God, but its real name's Godzilla. And yeah, might be going to a show, might be going to training, might be going to eat for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Keith Gavin's house working on Matt Raby's gimmicks. And yeah, show the river since we're over here on Tennessee River. So yeah, we were working on Matt's gimmicks at Keith Gavin's house. And I found out, if y'all didn't know, Keith Gavin's is a legit fucking badass. Just go up to him and ask him what that poor Peru family thought. So, <laughs> we're about to go, me and Brittany, who's filming, we're about to go eat where Sable signed her contract with WWF. We just got here, I meant to say, Dr. Tom or JPWA, whoever runs that page, had made a post. We were just on that bridge. Here you go. They had made a post talking about how this was the place that Jim Cornette told her she was getting the contract, so Brittany likes Sable. So oh, yeah. that's why we're eating here tonight. One of the reasons we're eating here. Well, the wait was too long, so no, no countings. Well, this one's just as good, but nobody signed a contract here, so. Daddy, is your second appearance? No, Joey thinks there's not going to be a winner no, they to the fight. Be a winner. It's an exhibition, boy. There's going to be a winner. <laughs> What do you mean? There's not. What do you mean? Wait. What do you mean? What do you mean by that? It's not a real one. There's not gonna be a winner. It's like the Mike Tyson fight. It's like the fucking. I think even the Connor. Mike Tyson and fight. The Mike Tyson and fucking Roy Jones oh, yeah. Jr. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They. There's no winner. It was all for charity. But how can there not be a winner? It's because. Hey, fat tabby. I hope Mayweather knocks him out. They're trying to leave it up to make you think that it's going to end in a knockout. But... Oh no, it, I, I, I'm smart about that. <laughs> but yeah, that island is kind of neat. Like, it's small. You ain't going to an island. Bullshit. It's fucking working us. You sure? Oh, yeah. When are they going to stop making purges? Forever. <laughs> All right. Broken Maranalo. We got. We got Ozzy Osbourne. We got what else? What else did you say? I said um, Shiny Jack Nicholson. <laughs> Jack Nicholson. <laughs> Where did he go? No one was expecting this. What? <laughs> Bro, Mayweather over. Oh, oh, he's oh. gonna knock him out. Right oh, this round. Old Polly Boy ain't got a chance. I'm telling you, he's too big, too bulky. Please knock him out right now. Oh, oh. it was so close.
We're gonna see this poor boy get knocked out. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes like a shark. Oh, he's just, da, he's shaking his head. Da, he's scared. Da, 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 Ooh, <laughs> shit. Go in the distance. Ooh, shit. Ooh, he, did he get tagged? He <laughs> just suplex. What's up, guys? So, that fight was pretty dope, not gonna lie. I think it went above my expectations as far as a fucking exhibition goes. Because I was thoroughly entertained, even though I really feel like Floyd probably could have and should have destroyed Logan Paul a little earlier. I don't know a whole lot about boxing myself. I just think Logan dude looked pretty bulky and obviously wasn't very, wasn't near as experienced as Floyd. But yeah, nice, entertaining night, fun night over at Joey's house, drinking, chilling. Watching some fighting. But yeah, I just wanted to make a, a little disclaimer here because uh, this is going to be the end of this episode. But uh, yeah, I'm not trying to be like great or anything like that. Like, not trying to be like the next great YouTuber or vlogger or something like that. Like, I don't expect anything to come from all this. This is mainly to me, for me to look back on me and my circle, the small circle I got for us to look back on in the distant future when I'm fucking probably too broken to do wrestling or anything anymore. Yeah, I'm not trying to be like great though. So just keep that in mind. I don't give a shit who ever, who sees this vlog. If no one ever sees it, that's perfectly fine with me. But yeah, <laughs> I'm still gonna try to fucking have fun with it. I'm having a lot of fun with it. Doing more and more shit so I can actually have some material to show so I'm not just showing training all the time. And yeah, it's fucking raining. So I'm gonna go inside because my shit is getting wet and it's not lit anymore. So not lit's not good. Peace. Peace.